you've been in the political arena, you know, with your family and, and in serving in your own capacity for, I guess, four or five decades now. Oh, in the 70s, I'm thinking through yeah, with your father's yeah. background. If there, so this next question is, is there a difference in today's leaders than in past generations? I guess maybe in your case, when you first came to Frankfurt, is it a different dynamic now than it was then? Or in any of your experience as a politician or you know, leader? You know, there is. Um, when I first came to the General Assembly, let me back up a little sure, bit. When, sure, when, when I first started out in politics, here in Jefferson County, as you said, you know, skipping school to uh, work <coughs> yes, at the yes. polls for uh, Ron Mazzoli. Yes. Uh, you know, we had some really great leaders around mm -hmm. that time in the 70s, early 80s. Uh, Harvey Sloan. Mm -hmm. uh, I worked for a while for Bruce Miller. Yeah. Um, Dara Owens has been a mentor yeah. of mine since I was a teenager, and now here we are sitting yeah. next to each other uh, well. in legislature. Um, and when I first went to the House, you know, we had these these really statesman-like folks that that um, were able to to make really hard decisions and hard votes, and go back home and get reelected. Mm -hmm. And I, I I feel like in that time we've come to a point where um, it's a little bit more difficult for some people to to make those hard votes. Um, that, that you have so much more access, the public right. does, yeah. to everything that, that politicians do and elected officials do, that I think sometimes our generation right mm -hmm. now might be a little too careful okay. and look over the shoulder a little too much. And you know, sometimes you just gotta say, plow right through, let's do the right thing and, and we'll sort it out later. Mm -hmm. um, but I think I think it's you know it's it's I think all the transparency mm -hmm. and all the access is a good thing. Right. But it's going to take a while I think for elected officials to learn how to live in that fishbowl. It's become even more so. This is maybe not a fair question, but do you ever see that there's instances of individuals that they're looking for the next election and they're not and they're losing sight of legislation? And you can do a yes or no. You don't have to elaborate on that. Or, or oh, sure. You know, sure. With within. Um, the large group that we have, sure. you know, legislature, metro council, sure. you know, there's always going to be some folks that are really ambitious. Okay. Um, and that's not a bad thing. Right. I mean, no, not, and I, I wasn't inferring that. I was just but, curious. But there are some people that, that you know, are going to If there's to more look. emphasis now than maybe in prior generations or what have you. Oh, I don't know if, it, you know, mm -hmm. I've only been around a couple generations, <laughs> so I can't speak I for... Understand. But, I understand. But um, I think things move uh, maybe a little faster. Okay than they used to. Okay. You know, and, and that would have some pros and some cons to it. Okay.